When you're the short stack in the blinds and you pick up the aces. What's the play here? Do you limp? I, I mean, I I probably just make a normal raise here. Well, just, he's only got 11 big blinds. Yeah, though. he's just got to go all in and hope that, that otherwise it looks suspicious, I think. He could also limp in and hope that Matthews pounces on it. But so far, early on here, we haven't seen a tendency on the part of Harvey Matthews to jump on uh, somebody just for limping in or, or for playing slow. He doesn't seem that aggressive to me, so. Let me just uh, play devil's advocate. Go ahead. If you're a Caputo, do you have a limping range from the small blind down 11 big yeah, blinds, or are you eight. folding or shoving all in? I think it's a fold or shove spot. Yeah, I'm right about 1-8. So that's why, to me, this would be suspicious if I were in the big blind, because what hands are you limping? Matthews doesn't take the bait. He just checks, and we're going to see a flop. Yeah. See if Matthews gets any piece of it. He does. He gets a pair of deuces, and that might be enough to for Caputo to get some value. A little backdoor diamond action, too, don't forget. These are the kind of hands that a lot of players like to peel one off with. Let's see what Caputo does. He's got about three times the pot, a little more, in his stack. Just wants to try to get a little value for his aces here. And you got to give Caputo credit. If he was just interested in surviving, he probably moves all in. But he's willing to gamble a little bit to get some value from his aces. Obviously, he's at risk 22% of the time. He will lose this hand. Yeah. 20, but he does get some value. 22% is not an insignificant number. 22% of the time, Caputo is going to get very bad news. But still, you have Ooh. to go for value. And there's one of those cards. Oh. <laughs> giving uh, Mr. Matthews a little bit more equity here. He now has a pair and a flush draw. Yeah, pot is 800,000. Caputo has 1.6 million. What is the bet here? And then I assume you're moving all in on the river. Yeah, I'm just going to try to set it up. I just put in another small bet, maybe a 250. I really want to get caught. I'm trying to double up with these aces. Yeah, if you're you beat hoping them, you your beat opponent's got a, you know, 6-3, 10-7. Yeah. Something that can call. But if he bets too much, he's going to lose his fish on the line. And looks like 300. I don't know if Matthews is going anywhere. Matthews has got a pair of deuces and a flush draw, and now he's got the chips to gamble with. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I'll be shocked if he folds. He may even shove. General rule of thumb, if you have a pair and a flush draw and you're wearing an all-good hat, you're not folding. All right. That was in the first edition of Super System. He's considering his options. He's not thinking about folding. No, I mean, he's getting nearly four to one, right? That's all he needs. That's regardless of the implied odds, if he hits his hand, if a deuce comes off, a seven comes off, or a diamond comes off, he's actually getting the right odds. Does he ever move all in, though? Well, I think that Caputo is too short. I, I would not want to move all in here. I I'm sure he's thinking about it. but well, he's That's just what he does. He is all in. And Caputo got what he wanted. Caputo yeah. got action with his aces, but now he's got to sweat it. He's got to avoid a deuce, a seven, <clears throat> and a diamond. 30% yeah. of the time, Caputo will be yeah. out in fifth place right here. Not crazy about this play by Matthews. I think that Caputo was pot committed, unless he was bluffing. And if he's bluffing, you definitely don't want to shove. Yeah, more on that in a second. Pot is 3.9 million. Does Caputo get back in this right here? He does not. It's like oh. you knew. You said the backdoor diamonds. Again, and Matthews makes the flush. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Nice with you, Brandon. Matthews cannot Here. lose today. Thank Harvey you. Matthews is Thank an you. absolute. He is just running like the sun. He's on fire. Yeah.